हाँ जी गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स सो आई विल डिस्कस अबाउट दी आई थिंक वी हैड डिस वी हैड कन्वर्सड रिगार्डिंग द एक्सपेरिमेंट रिलेटेड टू वी आई करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ जीना डायड सो दिस इज किट और रिलेटेड टू दैट एक्सपेरिमेंट दैट इज जीनर दिस इट्स मैंशन हेयर जस्ट चेक जीनर डायड वोल्टेज रेगुलेटर करेक्टरिस्टिक्स राइट दिस इज अ किट फॉर एक्सपेरिमेंट टू स्टडी वी आई करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ to study vi characteristics of zener diode or you can say to study voltage regulating characteristics of zener diode so this is the input voltmeter this one is you just check this is the input voltmeter this one is the output voltmeter this one right and uh, knob for varying the input voltage from here we vary the input voltage this one is the dc supply as we can see the experiment as we can see the uh, circuit diagram in the graph this just see this circuit diagram circuit diagram is dc supply connected to input voltmeter connected to series resistance it's connected in series to ammeter then the zener diode is connected to input voltmeter here the zener diode it is connected to input voltmeter then you can see load resistance it is connected to it connected in parallel to uh, zener diode connected in parallel to input voltmeter and then output voltmeter is connected to it is it is also connected in parallel and from here output voltmeter so we get the output voltage right so this is the kit i just connect this it's already uh, circuits are already internally connected just check this one is the input voltmeter v1 and output voltmeter here then series resistance rs from here you can see rs here this series resistance is here it is 150 ohms right and this is series resistance then uh, output voltmeter dc power supply then input voltmeter v1 is input voltmeter v2 is the output voltmeter this one is the input voltmeter and this one is the output voltmeter and then this is the rs series resistance 150 ohms and these are the two uh, leads uh, you can say two pins here two holes in here we connect the lead we just connect this to this one and uh, this is connected now we just connect the another lead that is 3 to 4 we just connect this one is this this is a zener diode zener diode right and uh, last is the load resistance this one rl here it's mentioned here are a load resistance right just check this is this one is a load resistance it's mentioned here and, uh, and this rl load resistance here we vary this load resistance from this knob from this knob right so now now so we just connect the second uh, uh, lead second means we just connect this lead see with the Point four, right? I just connect the leads. Now the circuit is complete. We can see, and we know that Zener diode always work in reverse bias conditions. So I just uh, on this, right? It blinks, blinks. Now vary the value of input voltmeter, or you can say input voltage, or you can say power supply. I just vary the value of input voltage. Just check its voltage here. Voltage is varying, right? I just vary here, and it increases. But here, one more thing you have, you can see that if we increase the voltage at a particular input voltage, the output voltage becomes constant. As you can see, if we increase the input voltage, the output voltage is constant here, right? At this point, at this point, the output voltage is constant. so what you will do just make a table and increase the value of input voltage up to 3 or 4 intervals 3 or 4 small divisions as you can see here this one now the needle is as fourth division fourth division means 4 into least count of this voltmeter 4 into least count of this voltmeter corresponding to this out value of output voltage is measured here right uh, note the value 
फिफ्थ डिवीजन इन टू लीस्ट काउंट ऑफ दिस आउटपुट वोल्ट मीटर राइट दिस इज द फर्स्ट डिवीजन एंड वी मेक लोड रेजिस्टेंस एट सम कॉन्स्टेंट वैल्यू वी टेक दिस लोड रेजिस्टेंस आर एल वी टेक कॉन्स्टेंट राइट सो वी टेक आर एल कॉन्स्टेंट एट वन के वन के मीन्स वन थाउजेंड ओम्स राइट नो इंक्रीज इन ऑर्डर टू टेक द सेकेंड ऑब्जर्वेशन इंक्रीज द वैल्यू ऑफ इनपुट वोल्ट मीटर वी इंक्रीज अप टू टेंथ डिवीजन टेंथ डिवीजन मीन्स अप टू दिस राइट टेंथ डिवीजन नाउ टेन इन टू लीज काउंट ऑफ दिस इनपुट वोल्ट मीटर कॉरस्पॉन्डिंग टू दिस नोट द वैल्यू ऑफ आउटपुट वोल्ट मीटर राइट सो जस्ट नोट द वैल्यू इट्स एलेवेंथ डिवीजन इन टू लीस्ट काउंट ऑफ दिस आउटपुट वोल्ट मीटर राइट सिमिलरली इंक्रीज द वैल्यू ऑफ इनपुट वोल्ट मीटर फ्रॉम दिस नोव by uh, small intervals or by small steps and note the value of corresponding output voltage right from this you can draw the graph between uh, uh, input voltmeter versus output voltmeter and graph should be like this take points and from those points draw the point uh, draw the graph take those observations from a table and from those observation draw the points on the graph paper and from graph paper the graph should be like this input voltage versus output voltage and graph should be like this right and this is zener voltage at this peak point this is the zener voltage right now what you will do this is for first case first case means input voltage versus output voltage now what you will do now take uh, suppose uh, the output voltage is means here it is constant na at some specific value so take i i just uh, fix the value of input voltage for second case i just fix it here suppose i just fix it here here suppose here at this at some specific value here i just fix it i just fix it here then after this after fixing the input voltage i only vary the value of rl this is rl this is load resistance uh, vary the value of load resistance and note the value of output voltmeter aapne isko vary karna hai aur output voltmeter ki values note karni hai so i just start i just uh, start from first 100 ohms from take 100 ohms make table make vertical table here like this in the first column write uh, this load resistance rl in the second column make heading output voltage rl versus output voltage okay what you will do first in the first value take 100 ohm as rl and corresponding to this note the value of output voltage right corresponding to this note the value of output voltage here you can see the output voltage is uh, at 10 15 17th division you just check the output voltage at division the needle is at 17th division right so uh, corresponding to this the needle is at 17th division means 17 into least count of this output voltmeter so least count you will uh, Uh, get from this experiment from this meter its least count is suppose 10 small scale divisions equal to 2 main scale division means 0.2 is the least count of this voltmeter okay now at 100 ohm this division is at uh, this needle is at 17th position here you can check 17 17.5 17.5 into least count 17.5 into least count this is the first observation now vary the value of load resistance up to vary it to 150 ohm corresponding to 150 ohm again note the value of output voltage from output voltmeter again uh, note the second observation third in the table now third observation for 200 ohm note the value of output voltmeter for 300 ohm again note the value of output voltmeter for 400 ohm again note for 500 ohm again note it right like this so just uh, make a tabulated data from that tabulated data 
just take that data and draw the points on a graph paper and from that graph paper uh, after making points we just trace those points and the graph of that uh, graph paper should be like this load resistance load resistance versus output voltage the graph should be like this clear this is the graph for second uh, observation second observation table clear thank you very much thanks thanks a lot and this is a kit for zener diode voltage regulating characteristics i again repeat this and uh, make sure the connection should be tight and the, those are connections should be rust free and these are some of the precautions which you should have to take it thank you very much thanks a lot